All right, let's play some blues over that uh, rhythm track that we put together earlier. And if you remember, the first chorus, the first time around on that blues track, there were no substitutions, no half steps. Basic, basic blues. Then the second chorus has a little more of the half step above approach. So let's play some blues and uh, have some fun. So I led us pretty good out of that four chord, didn't I? But I'm going to imitate that. Going to the five. Let's try to see if we can incorporate that melodic minor when we go to that four chord. Kind of worked. Here it comes again now, going to the four chord. Then I'm right back to the pentatonic, cool blues stuff. our chorus without so many uh, half step above so I'll just play some blues for you do it again remember the vibrato we talked about on my first DVD gotta practice that some chromatic stuff that we talked about. All right, a little more melodic minor stuff, maybe. That was that G melodic minor scale leading to the four chord. G melodic minor scale leading to the four chord. Notice the dynamics right there. That's not a hard lick. But it's interesting when you tip around the dynamics. I'll do a little more of that dynamic stuff. Great imitation right there. You like sliding like that? And that space that I just left. It's like a singer. You sang a lick, and then you have to take a breath. Space. And then finish the line. Like a singer, right? And here comes the melodic minor scale, the G melodic minor. Led us right to the four chord. Pedal. 
pedal tone. 